So we are here outside Samadhi Bali and this is a health uh, restaurant and also they have yoga and different spa treatment and other spiritual activities but today we're gonna try their food and see how it tastes like. down and checking out the delicious menu yeah and this is so cool this menu so. uh, blood purifier and it's with green apple celery stalled watercress parsley beetroot and a dash of lime juice so that will be very interesting to try really nice you can feel the watercress you can feel the beetroot and uh, all the other flavors coming up and it's really nice. I thought it should be a bit more sweeter but it was not so sweet and really nice and refreshing. So here we have the cool smoothies and I like the presentation that we have it in the glass jars like this with a bamboo straw. And this is banana, spinach and what was more? Spinach and lime and I think it was mango. Let me check. Spinach, cucumber, yeah. Banana, spinach, cucumber, and lime. Sorry for that. Let's try it. Really delicious. Like really sweet from the bananas. And also, you feel like the lime and the spinach. But I don't feel so much cucumber, but the banana and the spinach, really good. I love banana and spinach together. Cheers. So here we have the rice and shine juice and it's pineapple, spinach, lime and green apple. It looks really cool with this bamboo straw. Just gonna mix it around a little bit, you see the flavors. Mm, really good, a lot of apple and pineapple. You can feel the spinach, like a really good combination of all of them. I'm gonna try the rice rolls they have. Yeah. See if I can get all. Oh, now it's really hard to get it sticks together. So I'm gonna try it. It's gonna cut up a piece. I think it looks like it's some only like vegetables inside. It smells really good. And I'm gonna take some this avocado mousse put it on top and let's try it bite. look how oops so look how yummy let's try it mm. Mm. Mm, it's really good I think something is marinated mm. it's really good crispy Yes, we're gonna try the raw gazpacho and it's tomato, capsicum or red bell pepper, uh, some cilantro, garlic, uh, some uh, uh, cucumber and uh, yeah, a couple of other things like vinegar and some other things. We're gonna try. Really nice, really nice flavor. Uh, personally, maybe I should have shot in some like cilantro hole in there so it gets a bit more color. But it's really nice and tasty and really refreshing. Really nice, a hot summer day like this. Thank you. Thank you. So here also you can uh, create your own salad. So I have created my own signature salad. It's some salad and cucumber and red quinoa and some um, corn and some kimchi and gluten-free bread and under that we have some chickpeas. chickpeas, tomatoes, zucchini and the mushrooms. So I'm gonna try it. Take some quinoa, some... maybe I take a spoon. Oh and some guacamole. And some guacamole, sorry for that. 
Let's uh, take some quinoa, maybe some zucchini. Maybe try the sauerkraut. Like that, it's a good size. So let's try it. Mm. Mm. The kimchi is really good. You give this a little bit like the fermented taste and the saltiness. And also, quinoa is really cook, uh, cooked perfectly. Um, crispy and light, not mushy. Yeah, it's a good salad. I really like that you can create your own salad. And I took a salad with guacamole, uh, salad, uh, lettuce, chickpeas, some olives, cucumber, sauerkraut, tomato, and some gluten free bread. And red rice. We ordered uh, kombucha, somebody's uh, own kombucha. I don't know what it tastes. Is. It smells just fermented. What flavor is it? I can't tell the flavors because it <laughs> tastes so much like apple vinegar. <laughs> I'm more used to kombucha with sparkling and a bit of flavor, but this now the vitamin juice have come in and it is carrot, orange, coconut water and a hint of ginger. Sounds delicious. Smells so good mm. from the orange, mm. it's like a tropical. So, I'm gonna try it. In this bamboo straw. Mm. Mm. You can really taste them. Um, yeah, you, you get the um, little bit hint of ginger, but mostly I. Yeah, you get some of them. I think it's mostly like taste like orange juice. And a little bit of um, um, carrot also, but yeah, and the ginger, cool combination. A salad with the tabbouleh. Tabbouleh, yeah, the tabbouleh. And you had a tabbouleh with? Yeah, red rice and uh, some uh, radish, uh, parsley. You can see inside here and. Some other stuff. I tried, I tried mainly the tabbouleh here. This looks delicious. Mm. 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 Really, really nice. Mm. So now I'm gonna try the tabbouleh with quinoa. I really like quinoa. So yeah, I'm gonna try some with the. Maybe take a tomato. Get some crispiness. Let's try it. Mm. Really good. Mm. A lot of parsley, and that's really good. So now we're gonna try the digestive and the ingredients. Was uh, can you um, read for me, maybe? Yeah, it's pineapple, rocket leaves, coriander, ginger, and mint. That sounds really nice. I'll try. And some ice. Mm. Mostly taste pineapple, but really nice and refreshing. Or what do you say? Do you like it? <laughs> so now we finish with the meal and pretty filled up. Yeah, it was amazing food. Yeah, uh, I think I pretty liked everything, but um, my most favorite was to create your own salad because then you can just choose whatever you like, and I really love that. And it was a good value for the money because this was a big portion. Everything was a pretty big portion. Yeah, I really like the portions here. They were really big, so you get really good value for your money. And also the price uh, range is uh, really good as well. Yeah. And uh, for me, I also like the salad uh, that you could create own and also the tabbouleh. But I was pretty filled up now in the end. So and uh, but uh, i didn't really like the kombucha it was not really the kombucha i'm no, used to eat it too much apple cider vinegar too strong like yeah but otherwise i liked everything like i think the juices i had in the beginning that was also yeah my favorite. The juices and the are really good yeah and the smoothie also smoothie was also one of my favorite the yeah. green smoothie and uh, yeah uh, also it's quite a lot of dishes that includes nuts so I couldn't have uh, some of them I was thinking of taking so 
Uh, if you're not uh, allergic to nuts, this is a really good place. If you're allergic to nuts, there are also some dishes you can eat. Yeah. But ask first so you really know. Because yeah. sometimes it doesn't say on the menu, so just be sure if you're not allergic if you're allergic to nuts, just ask him in advance. Absolutely, because I was thinking of taking a chickpea curry, but then I talked to the chef and he said into the curry paste it was peanuts, so you have to be really alert, but it was not written down in the menu, so always check before. Yeah. Yeah, and also I really like the menu, and it was easy to read, and yeah, what more can we say? This was a fabulous yeah. meal. Absolutely, if you are around in Xiangu, we really recommend to drop in, but also another uh, downside or downside, maybe not, but uh, this is a lunch restaurant, or they open till, is it 3? 3 o'clock, I think three it's 3 o'clock. Yeah. So I would really like to go here for dinner as well, but uh, yeah. It's mainly a lunch restaurant. Yeah, but they have amazing food and breakfast. Uh, a lot of different breakfast uh, menus, a lot of Indians, um, Indian inspired for dishes. So, yeah. Yeah, really like this place. Yeah. So, if you like this video, please put a thumbs up and subscribe to our channel if you haven't done it yet. Yes. And if you have anybody that's are in this area or do you know anybody that's going to Bali, please share this video with them so they Absolutely. can come here. Have you been on this restaurant uh, yourself? Please. Put a comment down below and tell us what you think about it. Yeah, and please share it on any social media. Have yeah. a beautiful and have a fruitful day. Bye, bye from bye. Bali.